Well, Logan, we meet again. I knew, I knew with my response that I'd strike a chord with you, and that's okay. Hell, that's really all I've done my entire career is piss you off and whatever else. I bring out the best or worst, depending on how you look at it, in you. But some of the things that you said in that response, truthful. Some of the things that you said, I don't agree with. First things first, yes. Yeah, when me and you were running around Oblivion 2.0, yeah. Yeah, you did help me win the ACW World Heavyweight title. I didn't ask for it. But yeah, you did. Uh, you know, you, you had my back. Yeah, you did. But I had your back. Me and you, we caused a lot of hell for the ACW guys. We did. But I did what I did, Logan, to prove a point to you. It was to prove a point that I didn't need you anymore. You see, and even now, even now, our careers are still intertwined. Even though you've been doing this a whole lot longer than I have, who's got more titles under their belt? Who's got more world titles under their belt? Who's got more passion, more fan support for this, Logan? Sure, you might say that this is your life and that you love it and that you may have had multiple concussions and that whatever else you can say whatever you want about me Logan but you want to know the truth right now you don't have to like me but you damn sure better respect me that goes for everybody because I don't like to toot my own horn very much but ever since I returned yeah, maybe I have been lacking compared to how I was last year and the year before. But you want to know something? This isn't kayfabe. This isn't some storyline made up bullshit. You want to know the 100% truth? I'll give it to you. I've got two herniated discs in my back. I've got low circulation in my left leg. I was told... I was told by multiple doctors that I should stop, that I should just hang it up, that I should just give up backyard wrestling. But I'm not going to, because this is my fucking life. Whether we have 100 subscribers, 10 subscribers, 10,000 subscribers, it doesn't matter. As long as SVBW is still standing. I will be a part of it somehow. I will. Because for the months that I was away, that killed me. Because I missed the competition. I missed my fans. Hell, I missed me. So Logan, before you hop on here, and you run your mouth about me, you call me names, I want you to look in the mirror. Because without Mikey Reedy, there would be no fucking Dark Wolf Logan Price. 
If it wasn't for me, Logan, you would still be that pathetic, sorry excuse for a backyard wrestler like you was in GSW. You want to say that you gave me all of my success? Nah. You handed me one title. Look at my accolades, though. I have probably the best first year in backyard wrestling compared to anybody else. Two weeks in, two weeks in, I had a championship. Where was you at, Logan, when I was two weeks into my career? Oh yeah, that's right. That's right. You got kicked out of GSW. Mm hmm? For the, what, first time? Where was you at, Logan, when I was main eventing with Dustin Little, when I was winning independent championships, having triple threat matches with, with Clay Mercer, Hunter Becker? You was sitting behind the fucking commentary table while I was doing my thing. I'll give it to you, Logan. This is coming from the only three-time, the longest reigning Valor champion. You've done a pretty damn good job with that title so far. Hell, you're the second longest reigning champion. Congratulations. But I want you to know something, Logan. You can claim to be the damn mountain but if you are the supposed mountain then I'm the f motherfucking flag on the top of that mountain you see because my entire career and most of yours we have tried to one up each other I think the reason why me and you hate each other so much Logan is because in a way, we're a lot alike. We just have to one-up each other. If you get a title, I have to have a title. If you win more matches, I have to win more matches. I, I respect you, Logan. I really do. I respect all you've done for me. Hell, for the entire backyard wrestling business, I respect it. But I, what I don't respect is you walking around here with a giant ass chip on your shoulder thinking, I'm the mountain, I'm the best, oh, I've got a beard and I'm going to start the beard brigade. Look, the difference in me and you, Logan, is I may have had different nicknames. I may have been called many different things. Madness, Black Sheep, Riot. But there was only one, there was one constant thing. I was the same guy. Through it all. 2018 to 2020, I have been the same guy. What have you been, Logan? You've wrestled with concussions and busted ears and, uh, you know, whatever else. And you may have blew your knee out with a, with a pedigree. I'm wrestling when I can barely walk. I 
may have to have surgery.